What's going on YouTube? Happy Wednesday everybody, it's Vikings95 here. We have an eBay football mystery hot pack for today's video, just like most Wednesdays. The packaging may look familiar because this is a seller I actually bought from a couple weeks ago. And so they came out with another repack it looks like. I mean, I did not tell them who I was. Uh, they might be able to figure it out, I guess. Uh, but I did not specifically say anything to them. I did not message them at all. So hopefully it's going to be random and it's going to be good. Uh, they actually already sold quite a few of them uh, before this video is even coming out. So they're doing well off of their last packs. And this one actually caught my eye as I was browsing repacks. So I wasn't even on their page. I clicked into it because the cards look cool. They have a good listing made. And uh, ended up looking at the, the previously sold items on their page. And it was the same repacks as before. So let's get into some of the details. We have Tier 1 Football Mystery Hot Pack. And the cool thing about this, there's actually two tiers. So I will uh, link both of the tiers in the description. Tier 1 is $18.99 plus free shipping. Tier 2 is really similar. It's just a couple dollars less with a couple fewer big hits. Uh, so, I mean, 20 bucks, around 20 bucks shipped. Pretty solid deal. Obviously, shipping costs around $4 or so, $4 to $5 if you add supplies as well, uh, especially with the shiny bubble mailer. And so, that's a pretty sweet deal. 30 to 35 cards. Uh, last time we got a bunch of random inserts, rookie cards. It was kind of fun. Minimum of 10 rookies. You get one hit, which can be an autograph or a jersey card. And a chaser, if it's not an auto or jersey, still counts as a hit. One rookie quarterback or rising star. Uh, there are 50 packs total in Tier 1 and 50 packs total in Tier 2. I did look at that listing right before as well. But I'm going to be mostly talking about the Tier 1 because that's what I have and that's what I'm reviewing. So there are photos of all seven chasers and then there's a bunch of chasers in there as well. It looks really cool. It looks promising. The biggest chaser by far in a way is a Trey Lance Mosaic Draft Autograph. That would be crazy to hit. Far and away the biggest chaser out of the uh, the seven. There's a Trevor Lawrence Certified Graffiti Insert. That would be a pretty sweet card. Uh, Deion Sanders, rookie BGS 8.5. That'd be nice. DeAndre Swift, RPA from Illusions. There's a Justin Jefferson Purple Shock Optic. I do not have that one yet, so we'll see. Uh, there's a Trevor Lawrence Draft Pick Silver rookie card. A Justin Herbert Select Red Die Cut SGC 8. And then this one wasn't even listed. It was a Baker Mayfield rookie jersey from uh, Donruss. I think it's a Rookie Phenoms one. So that would actually be a pretty cool one. Uh, I saw an Encase Devin Duvernay autograph on Cardado, I think. A uh, couple dual patch cards of Steelers. I mean, there's just a lot of really good looking stuff. So I'm excited for it. Let's see how we do. And uh, I don't know. I, th I think I might go buy one or two of the... Uh, Tier 2, just to try that one out as well, because Tier 2 honestly looked pretty solid. They had a good amount of cards. I think instead of 30 to 35, it was like 25-ish or so. And so, let's see. This is just a huge bubble mailer. <laughs> wow. All right. So I think at the time when I'm making this video, there's like 15 of these Tier 1s sold. What is this? I don't know what that is, but ooh, right off the back, I saw something on the back. Oh man, this, I wonder if this is the, ch I don't know if this is a chaser or not. I'm excited. I'm excited for that. We will see what that is. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I have no clue. I'm looking at it now. This is empty. Kind of hard to show you guys, but uh, with it being such a big bubble mailer. But here we go. Okay, I'm excited for this. It's a mystery package. It is not in a one touch. I can tell that. And so let's see. Let's see what we've got. Looks like we have a J.K. Dobbins. Sadly, he's hurt, but that is a very nice white die cut field level parallel. That is sweet. That is a, a great select parallel right there jk dobbins i hope he comes back strong look at that that's actually one of the Steeler cards i mentioned it is a tj watt Minka fitzpatrick dual golden pairs look at that we got the first one printed one out of 299 and uh 
That is sweet. This is actually the one I was talking about that I saw on the listing. Uh, it wasn't listed as a chaser or anything, just a cool card. So golden pairs, TJ Watt, Minka Fitzpatrick, one out of 299. Not bad. Not one of the chasers either, but I think that is a very nice hit right there. TJ Watt just got paid. This man got paid. He is a, uh, he's making a lot of money now. I think he's the most, I don't know, is he the most expensive uh, defensive player in the league? I can't remember how that went, but they paid him a lot. Let's put it that way. So uh, I'm going to put that card over the back. We're going to see what we got at the end. I do say, see a Justin Jefferson in his LSU uniform, the red cracked ice out of a 2021 Prism Mega Box. So we got that Justin Jefferson. Jerome Bettis, Hall of Fame, Mosaic. Let's see, toe the line, A.J. Green, Brian Dawkins, that's a red parallel. Trayvon Diggs from Optic, rookie card. A.J. Brown, that's a base. Antoine Winfield Jr., rookie. James Conner, player of the day. Is that numbered? It is not, surprisingly. Player of the day, James Conner. So that's the uh, that player of the day set. Isaiah Simmons, nice orange laser from Prism. You gotta love the shine on that. Patrick Sertain, the second Crusade Prism draft picks rookie. Big Ben Roethlisberger, Sam Bradford, Derek Carr, uh, Drew Brees, J.J. Watt. That is a blue parallel from Illusions. Nick Bosa from Playbook. T. Higgins rookie card. About halfway through that stack, Derwin James Jr., Mosaic, Denzel Mims, rookie, Willie Gay Jr., rookie, Aaron Rodgers, Brian Walters, Blake Bortles, Devontae Parker, TJ Watt again, Tremaine Edmonds, a James Morgan purple die cut, purple field level die cut. That's a cool looking card. Sadly, I don't know if he'll ever get his chance in the NFL, but uh, it's a cool looking card at that. Teddy Bridgewater, Aaron Rodgers franchise, Antonio Gates sidelines, Howie Long game faces, Christian McCaffrey with the silver select. That is the premier level silver select CMC. So I've, I've been trying to organize, trying to stay organized. We've got a bunch of inserts here. We have a bunch of rookies here, and then we have a bunch of base there. Keyshawn Vaughn, rookie, and then A.J. Dillon, rookie card. Sadly, it does look like it's got a little ding up in that corner. That would have been a sweet prism rookie if it weren't for that that ding up there. Dang. That would have been a nice prism rookie right there. Sadly, a little bit, little bit of a ding up there, uh, but here we go. I saw it in the beginning. I'm sure a lot of you did, too. We have a Justin Herbert Select Rookie. And that is honestly just icing on the cake. I think these two cards in general make up a pretty decent uh, hot pack. That J.K. Dobbins white die cut field level and then the T.J. Watt Minka Fitzpatrick golden pairs from Gold Standard. Those are sweet. Got some solid inserts. And then we have the Justin Herbert club, or, uh, yeah, club level rookie on the top and then we've got this i have no idea what this is let's see let's see what we've got all right okay so they did know who i was i should open this at the beginning all right, they did know who I was after I first bought it. Uh, obviously, they did get a huge spike in sales. So the review might be a little tainted now. Um, a huge thank you to uh, <laughs> a huge thank you to you and all of your viewers for your support with the mystery packs. We've included a small gift in your mystery pack and would like to offer free returns minus cost of shipping to any of your viewers who are not satisfied with their purchases. Thanks again. P.S. Can't say that. E.G. Wow, okay, so they did know who I was. That is a twist for me, but at the same time, I only heard positive feedback. So, uh, obviously this was not planned on my end. Um, 
I should have opened that first probably, but still. Uh, but it is nice that they did put a note in. At least it'll show on video. Uh, so there it is. It, they do know who I am. They do know it's on camera. I mean, they might not know this one's on camera, but this one is on camera, obviously. So uh, take it as you want, but obviously do your due diligence. I thought this was a great listing setup. Uh, I've loved these packs. They've done awesome. This is the third pack I'm reviewing of theirs, and uh, it has been great. So obviously this is not part of the hot pack. This is just a little bonus, like that letter said. And so here we go. Let's see what we got. It looks like... We got a little white or a disco leaf, Kellen Mond. Look at that. Leaf Flash, Kellen Mond on card auto, numbered five out of 50. Wow, they did not have to do that. Uh, if they know who I am, I'm sure they're watching this video. Thank you for this. That is awesome. Uh, that's my first Kellen Mond autograph and it is like the purple to match with the vikes obviously he's not in his viking uniform but it is a very cool card got the little white sparkle from leaf flash numbered out of 50 Woo! all right well that was that was sweet um definitely not planned took me by surprise but uh honestly hopefully that doesn't taint anyone's vision of this pack I thought it was a stellar repack. If they did know who I was, maybe uh, they might have thrown in something extra. I have no idea. But the first two rounds kind of spoke for themselves, in my opinion. Um, and I will probably be trying out the tier two as well. So it may not be super random, but hopefully it's still a good review for everybody. And uh, I appreciate you all watching regardless. So let me know your comments down in the description. I'm sure there's going to be a couple of people saying, you know, they loaded it for a YouTuber since they know who I was. But uh, I think they say right there, right there. We would like to offer free returns to anyone who's not satisfied. So I think that's big of them. Uh, I think they're showing that they have faith in their product. So that is my comments on it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll be sure to list them uh, down below. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you later.